Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, depending on where the fuck you are in the world. I am Mad Wedge and this is Retro Anime. How are you all doing? That was the longest ever fucking confusing as fuck anime I have played in a long time. I would be remiss if I said I understood even a single episode of Gintama because I fucking did not. There's a penguin in it. <laughs> Uh, I'd like to give a big shout out to everyone in the channel, by the way. I hope you're all having a wonderful evening, and I hope you've all had a great stream. We have upcoming anime next that you can fuck around with and turn around and change. Also, if Mr. Wolf is still here, just as a thank you for him giving bits, which he really didn't need to do. You know, you can share subs with people and things like that. It's really nice. I mean, sharing a sub's always better because, because um, then they don't have the adverts and they get to go and access the VODs. So, you know, I appreciate sending me bits, that's lovely, but share a VOD instead. So give somebody else a subscription, and then hopefully I'll pass it on to other people. But like I was saying, Mr. Wolf, is there a movie you would like? Can I provide you with an anime movie? Just as a thank you for being on the stream. I'm going to open the Discord up, because I think Frost is sat in there trying to kill things on CSGO, so he can at least chat to us while we're here. Uh, then I'll tell everyone what's upcoming anime, and you can tell me what you would rather watch. <laughs> because we're all about the people that are wanting to watch the stream, and that's the truth. Now then, where's my fucking Discord? Discord. There we go. Hail Frost. Hello. How are you doing? I am doing great. How are you? Oh, I was better when you talk normally, but other than that, I'm fine. <laughs> So we just finally got through Gintama, and as I was saying, it's literally just a fucking mess. I've no idea what went on in it. I have got the VOD to make, which I'm going to do right now for the movie. Once I've done that, then literally we've got ready to go. The upcoming animes that are in order at the moment, you guys can change around as much as you want. We have got... Oh, look up. That's all of Gintama. Yes. Yes, it is. 257 episodes plus a movie. That's all of Gintama. <laughs> 257 episodes in a movie. Fuck that. Better be all of fucking Gintama. Apart from the live actions. They are live actions, which we're not going to show. Uh, right, so Comet Lucifer is one that's up there. I thought there was like 300 or something. No. No, there's not. <laughs> and if there is, I'm not finding them. But I'm pretty sure there's not. Uh, so yeah, Comet Lucifer is one that's next. Then we've got How to Get a Kingdom Out of Debt, followed by Kino's Beautiful Journey, finished off with The Ash of Grimmer. Now then, you can have them, or you can have other. That's all fine and dandy. We're going to... Okay, fine. You win with that one. What? There is Gintama the Final. That was a new movie that just came out, to be honest. Even I know that. Son of a bitch. What? More Gintama. I fucking hope not. <laughs> well, there's... We didn't play all the movies, didn't we? We played one of the Gintama movies. There is one person that can make me play the Gintama the Final movie, and it's Mr. Wolf. And if you ask for it, you'll get it. Don't ask for it. <laughs> but he can have it if he wants. I'm really not bothered. <laughs> Trying to find the end of the Gintama movie. There it is. So did everyone enjoy the Gintama? Does somebody want to tell me their opinion on Gintama with a rating for it? Because I can't do it because I did not enjoy watching it, to be honest. I found it very confusing, so I couldn't really keep up with it. Yeah, I can't tell you. I didn't. It did turn out to be a very um, eclectic anime. People either liked it or they hated it. It's very Marmite. It's true. 
finish. All right, Gintama the final. I'm gonna look at it somewhere. There it is, Gintama the very final, it was called. <sighs> round and round, and where it stops, nobody knows. Uh huh, it's in there twice under S and W. Let's find it. Films. There it is. You have to excuse me when I'm making a VOD or finding something that's within the server. It's a large place. You can get lost very easy. So I have to find and pay attention. By the way, I've just done it. <laughs> All right. Okay, so I believe that that's done. Where are we at with the thing? Right, so I've gone and found it. It's hilarious, as I remember, like five years ago, and not the average linear comedy anime. That's very true. And almost every single anime trope is used throughout that series from Dragon Ball to Gundam to fucking anything. It, it literally doesn't take itself uh, very, very sensible at all. <laughs> Georgie Boolehole. Sup, Wedge? How you doing there, Georgie Boy? You good? <laughs> Are you having a nice evening? It looks like Mr. Wolf may be gone, so we don't have to put the last Gintama movie on there, Frost. <laughs> Uh, I'm okay. It is roughly about 20 to fucking 6 in the morning in the UK right now. The Docket. Well, we have three animes set to run, which are all 12 episodes apiece. We've got Comet Lucifer, followed by Getting a Kingdom Out of Debt. Uh, there is also... What's that fucking next one after Kingdom After Debt? Shit. Shit, shit, shit. So it's fucking unbelievably easy to remember, and I've forgotten it. Old age is not for the faint of heart, sons. Ah, Kinto's Journey, the beautiful world, the original one, and then it's uh, Ash of Grimmer. So, oh, thank you ever so much. I, I don't think I'm any different than anyone else, to be honest with you. I'm just a guy who likes anime and wanted to share it when the pandemic started. Luckily, I managed to get it done. <laughs> so... Those are the ones that are sat to play, but there are 12 diehard fans here right now. Obviously, some of you are probably asleep, uh, yeah. resting, and farming them points. Because points I mean, make anime prices. Points make points. Yep. Oh my god, yeah, Bear's in here, farming his points away. So let's have a quick look. Generally, when we think people are asleep, we look through. We've got Clan of Wolf. Now, I know he's gone to sleep. Spectre John. Hey, Spectre. He's probably awake. The Vatsman, 892. Hey, hello there, my friend. Uh, who we got here? Broke my stream deck. Yeah, it always makes me laugh. Uh, Flex to the world. Guitar Friedley's in. Just being very quiet. Lurker. Uh, Modern Knight, 123's in. Lurking away. Sea Vich and Rogue Girl, both are in. You know, there's not enough women on the channel. There really isn't. The Beard or Bear, he's not here. He's just farming points. And that's just to call out one or two people that are hiding in the wings. Not to mention the new people at Hazmat and Georgie Boy. The Vatsman is always welcome. But yeah, it's, it's, a good, it's a good collection of people we get on here. It always is. So, what we got? Cowboy Bebop movie? That's exactly how it works, my friend. Yep. You want the Cowboy Bebop movie? It's yours. <laughs> One second, I'll dig it out of the files. Films. Knocking on Heaven's Door. Right. 
right. Um, well, you can have... It's your choice. You can either have Cowboy Bebop. I wouldn't really recommend the Trigon one. Trigon movie is a bit gash, to be honest. The Trigon movie is only about the battle. And it's of a different input. So yeah, you went dead one. quiet then because you moved away from whatever mic you've got because you're just concentrating on your game. I'm, I'm not actually away from the mic at all. Well, then it died. Mm -hmm. Speak up. Cowboy Bebop movie. I mean, not Cowboy Bebop. Trigon movie is about the battle. That would be oh, it's just brought movie. up an interesting fact. You know, they turn, they change Wolfwood's voice. It's more than a travesty. It's a fucking shit for. Right, Cowboy Bebop, knocking him's door, bring that up. New, 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 new. Drop that in. There we go. Tell him to say it with his chest. I I could do, but I might get done for New Day. <laughs> right, so you've been added in. Cowboy Bebop Knocking on Heaven's Door is next. Um, is anyone else wanting to have a film picked with points or anything like that? So, before we set off, you see, the thing is, points are all well and good. You've got to use them. While I'm here, if you use them, it'll get more or less put in straight away. However, if you use the points when a full anime is running, depending on a show or a movie, it gets added to the end of that show or the end of that movie. So you can be waiting a little bit for it. And if you just throw it in there then and we don't see it, then it could take a couple of days to get it on. Generally, we do see it. We're not fucking useless. But we are lazy. <laughs> uh, no. Some days we are useless. Yeah, some days we are useless. I mean, a lot of the time, though, I'm either streaming games or I'm in the gym now or I'm being miserable because I'm dieting. It's a lot of fucking depressing shit, as well as running the anime stream, which, by the way, is not without its faults. Between power outages, computers dying, hard drives running out, and the ever fucking cuntiness of Twitch itself. Thank you for the follow, Victor. 10731. I am not a fucking number, I'm a name. You're a bloody number at the end of that cunt. <laughs> I'm on Team Useless. Look, Team Useless is really good. It's right next to Team Can't Be Shit, and I haven't got a fuck. It's a great place to be. Second to none of women can go fuck, because we're living the man-white dream. I mean, I have got a house which is 100% man cave. The sex is shit, but it's about the same as you'd expect for an anime nerd. <laughs> hey there, see which how you doing? <laughs> So, yeah, it, it's it's okay. But, I mean, if it wasn't for the vast amount of anime I have, I'd be bored. So, it's good. <laughs> oh. Just going to get myself one of those sexual body pillows. That'll probably fix it. Yeah. <clears throat> Cried against that for a while. No, now I made myself feel sad. <clears throat> so, is anyone else wanting to pick an anime and use points up before we... Look into the way that we're going to start stuff. I've just found Dante's Inferno as a film, Frost. Should I put it on? No. But it's Dante's Inferno. I'm playing the game and everything. No. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> There'd be some huge titties. <laughs> Fucking Jesus Christ. But it looks so innocent just being called Dante's Inferno. Alright, uh, I'm going to look for a movie to throw in as well, just for the hell of it. What should we do? How's this? Cute, you only tears. I haven't seen this. Oh god, they made a second live action Cute, you honey movie. No. They did? Okay, no. What's wrong with you? You just don't want to watch anything. Mother. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, fine. I'll pick some out random. Hey, Frost, is there a movie you want putting on? Not that I'm aware of. Right now. Okay. Uh, 
Connell Super. Can't put Connell Super on. There's too much. Oh, I nearly. Oh. It's a good job I fucking wound my neck in then. I saw I saw the island of giant insects. I'm like, ooh, I put. No. No one. Oh, I forgot they made that. Oh, well. It's only over here. For us, I can't think of a movie. My mind's gone blank. What kind of mind do you want to have there? Because yours is always blank. It's not so much blank. It's more like perverse at the moment. Everything I'm looking at is just up eye central. No, no, it's not that I forgot the name of it. It's trying to think of a movie that would be nice to put on for people, which doesn't have a vast amount of titties in it. Um, and it's not going to get anyone in trouble. Oh, this is... Uh, I don't think we've had this. Have we ever played a film called Psychic War? Uh, Psychic School Wars? Oh man, it, it looks very um, womany. Ground control to psychonautic girl. No, no, no. This, this, this looks like it's the art style is lovely, but it literally looks lovely. Do you know what I mean? You like it, lovely. Ronnie Kenshi. We can't put Ronnie Kenshi on because we haven't played the series. If we put the movie on, it's full of spoilers. One Piece films. Thankfully, we've done all the One Piece. It's all in the VODs. Fucking One Piece series. Jesus, that went on for a month nearly. We started that on the 17th of March. And it's, it was still going in April. About, what, 3rd or 4th of April or something silly or something like that? Jesus, that was long. Do you think we get away with Batman Ninja? Because that's technically an anime. <laughs> no, I know you were joking about it. That's why I was like putting my head down. Very soon we might be able to get some of them done, but my God. When we have long series, I'm just like, oh, we must have something new. we got to have something new. Because i don't want to be the same old channel where we just stream the same old stuff like everyone else i mean i'd love to put on my hero academia but it's too fucking long right now and i'm pretty sure at least another four people are running it uh like dragon ball we only ran dragon ball because everyone else is running all the other dragon ball supers dragon ball z nobody does dragon ball gt scumbags uh, because it doesn't get views we run stuff that's good you need some anime. Well, that's what I was just looking at. The the one that I was looking at was an IRL anime one. Anime documentaries? I'd rather boil my own piss and drink it. Fuck no. <laughs> Fucking anime documentaries. Have you gone barking? My God. Sit down in this corner and allow me to beat you in the testicles until you see sense. <sighs> Five cent per second. Garden of words. It's not five, five centimeters per second. Oh, what's five centimeters a second? And if anyone yeah, says my is. dick at high speed, I'm going to laugh. Your dick couldn't even go that far because it's not five centimeters. You five centimeters is tiny, man. Anyone's over five centimeters. Even the Chinese. You're five micrometers. Sir. What, did you use your own penis to measure it? It would, that mean you would be a lot closer to me. Not wrong with a bit of docking, I think it's fun. <gasps> the Animatrix, that's a good call, but we can't. There's nudity in that, I think. If 
Five centimeters per second. That's an anime. I don't think I've got it. When did it come out? Wow, well, yeah. Have to get some of the blur version for you. No, no. I d <sighs> That's probably something you could do, but I mean, who'd really want that? Really? I feel terribly cheated when they have a hot tub scene and there's more mist than there should be. Bastards. <laughs> Do audio. Nice, nice, nice. Boom. We got 40. Do audio. Sweet. Hit that. Open physics. She has a viewer which makes the movie seem safe. How the fuck do you do that? As in a viewer viewer or a viewer view? I've just said viewer four times. I didn't make myself clear. Is it a person who watches her stream that does it? Or is it a thing that she streams it through that does it? Oh, yeah. I'm just wondering how she blurs the nudity. Generally intrigued on how it's done. I mean, could you imagine a viewer that automatically blurs nudity for you? It would be kind of cool. Uh, just grab the last one. It's in the wrong file. I don't remember the program. That's interesting, though. I I'm going to have to look into that. Because if that's actually a thing, that may open up so many doors... To an what is you imagine if it fucks up on one stream though, right? It's it's been blowing everything totally fine until it comes to this one stream where it's an almost graphic sexual reveal of tittiness, and then all of a sudden it doesn't work. Be like handling, be like holding your balls over a blender with someone saying, "Don't worry, this mesh will save them," and you have to put all your trust in this tiny piece of mesh that your balls are going to be fine, and the next thing you know. The balls are fucking trapped. Jesus. I would cry so much. <laughs> God, yeah. Actually, yeah, let's go for a couple of movies. Why not? So, five centimeters per second. Um, hopefully, there's no nudity in it, because I haven't looked. I'm going to have to check it in a minute. If anyone has any more suggestions for movies, let me know. And we'll see what we can do. Oh, we got a call. Oh, what's this? They just missed the worst parts. A huge robot dick. Lol. The nice thing <clears throat> about anime is though that at least no genitals. True. No offense, but we have to stop it in the chat. Don't worry, I'll read it out. It's all okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the intro. <laughs> thank you for understanding. I appreciate that greatly. But yeah, if me or any of the mods are here, we'll deny it, but we'll read it for you first. <laughs> Because the audio section of the chat is totally fine. That's why we have an open Discord. Um, but when it comes to the written section, if you don't appear to be monitoring it, Twitch can get the ump. So you've just got to keep an eye on that. Okay, cut this. Move it to films. Anime. Oops, shit. First, don't even come in. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, second. So, quick look at this. So, yeah, if anyone's got the most suggestions for anime, we're looking for them now. I'm just going to throw a few over. You know, this is actually that five centimeters a second. It's got some really nice art style, art yeah. style in it. Have you seen it? Yeah. Watch it. 
Not on this one, we haven't. Have we? No, not on this one. I'm, I'm, I was just asking. I wasn't giving you shit. I'm, honestly, I was asking. No, we have not. Not on this. Thank you very much. All right, okay. Drop that in. Right, anyone any more movie suggestions? See, the people may be leaving the stream, but that's because they're stupid and they don't realise that we're giving away like stuff at the moment. Um... Ah, oh, crap. I was going to check something again. My fucking mind went to mush. Uh, ah, yeah. Mm. Oh, I got to shit my dad's fucking Oh. Oh. That's what I forgot to do. Hey, Nate Dog! How you doing? God damn! Oh, Nate Dog came. Holy shit! He just re subbed again. For fuck's sake! <laughs> Doesn't he just do that to do that? I, mean... I think he does. Yeah. Doing great. That's nice to hear, man. I'm glad you are. Huh. It is actually a thing. Um, what uh, Georgie Boole was on about, there's a player, it's called Clear Play, and it automatically censors nudity and offensive content of ordinary movies purchased or rented. That's a bit nuts. So, with the 15 views we've got, does nobody actually care about another movie? I'm going to leave this in a minute. It's one minute past six in the morning, so I am going to run away shortly and go to my bed, because I can hear it in the distance saying, Sleep, fat man, sleep. So, I know I have to go and visit it shortly. <laughs> oh, yes. The fat man needs to sleep. Okay. Censorship. Oh, does that do it? Let's go to no. Oh, 22 people. Welcome into the stream, by the way. Is there anybody that has any requests for movies? Um, movie, 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 movie. Not that I'm aware of. Movie, movie. Movie. Sleep well. Thanks a lot, Def Prague. That's lovely of you. I appreciate that. That's so nice. But we can't sleep until we find you guys some anime. 
I did think you'd been missing for a while, Nate. I did wonder what happened. I don't know if there's a way of doing it. Hmm. Media player to sense the nudity. How to disable... See, every time I type it in, it's just like how to disable nudity in Rust. I don't care about Rust. I care about nudity in anime. Ah, how to censor movies quickly. A strong storm knocked out my internet last week. Jesus Christ, I'd go livid. What's this about? The media plays in this feature. Windows and G1. Simple cutting out the section of the movie. Don't, you don't watch. Right, apparently a lot of people are using something to remove full frontal nudity because they make them feel uncomfortable in front of their parents. All I can think of is Johnny Bigborn is sitting there going boing in front of his mum and dad and they're like, Excuse me, Sonny. What's the matter, darling? You've got wood in your pants. Yeah, ain't it fucking great? Boing. No, apparently they're just removing it for that. Mm-hmm. Final Cut Pro X, what's this? Blur or pixelate areas of a video, we can offer. Okay, that, that works. Ah, oh, nah, but you gotta re encode the video first. See, that would be a pain in the ass. To do that, you'd literally have to run the entire anime through this fucking thing and blur the titty section yourself. I'd rather plat piss than do that to an anime I like. I would rather run down the street naked being chased by a bull with a hard on. Knowing I couldn't get away and I'm still going to get violated at the end of it. I would willingly go to a bukkake party and serve myself up as the tray. You could just do that with any fucking fucking coding software. Just use an effect and fuck it off. That's not what I wanted. Do you know what's really wrong about all of this? If you have an anime that's either censored or non-censored, technically it's still an art form. Now, would you walk into the Louvre with a fucking angry Karen and walk up to the fucking titty statues going, Yes, it's unclean for you guys. There's some poor little fucking woman stood there with a two-year-old baby feeding on a nipple like it's a fucking fastathon. And then there's another guy going, Oh, yes, I do marvel at David's cock. It's rather limp and flaccid, but his balls are well presented in the marble. I mean... It's art. Technically, it's anime art, but it's still fucking art. If you're looking for good editing softwares, regardless, DaVinci Resolve is a glitch software in free. I do have DaVinci Resolve, and I was using it for when I was doing my 4K motorbike videos. So I'd literally drive around the area where I live, filming on a GoPro in 4K, and then I'd load them up to uh, YouTube after I'd done beautiful videos especially in summer i'll be starting doing that again soon also at the moment i'm building a trailer to go on the back of my motorbike so i can tour around castles 
and Abbey's in the UK uh, and see how I do living in a field. Not going to like it. I'm really not. People are going to love it because I'm going to be torturing myself. Frost will be getting hard just thinking of the times I can't eat. So, yeah, it's going to suck. Because <laughs> the way I'll have that set up is I'll fill the camper with stuff to live off when I leave. But if nobody watches the stream and nobody helps me out while I'm traveling, I'm going to run out of food and I'm going to end up coming back because I'm only going to have what I have when I leave. And it's all about if the stream can keep me traveling, how far I get. I'm not looking forward to it. I could either just get out of the town and end up coming back. Or... The worst part, I'd end up all the way traveling the world in a fucking motorbike with a camping trailer on the back because everyone keeps tipping bits and shit, so I can't stop. That would suck. Can you imagine driving all the way to America on a motorbike just because people kept giving me bits on Twitch? That'd be a nightmare. Jesus, I, I don't even want to contemplate that. I'd end up with a beard and be a hobo, man. Don't get me wrong, the anime is still run because I can do it all remotely now. I don't even have to come back to my house to put electric in. <laughs> my entire house is automated, so if I walk out the door today, I can still access the PCs, access the house, and run everything just from my phone. So that's not even an issue. Which makes it worse. Frost, I, I mean, don't want to do it. <laughs> yeah, too bad. Fuck out there and do it. Oh, I think it'd be a bad idea. I mean, it probably would be, but I mean, I want to see you suffer. Oh, I'd suffer. I'd suffer badly. Yeah. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September. Yeah, it's going to be like October, November time when the uh, trailer should be finished. It's a great idea. It's really not. It's anything but a great idea, and I know that for a fact. But I appreciate you being nice. <laughs> uh, yeah, because you imagine you'd, you'd get to a place and be like, right, it's so much to do this in the next area. Or I've only got like two two tank of petrol left. This is how much it is for more petrol. And it's like, I can't go any further if I don't get that uh, sent via PayPal or something. And then it's like, right, I can go home today. That'd be great. Your library and setup is the library of Alexander of Anime. Man, you should see my library of anime right now. It's savage. Hold on. I think I could show you above me here if I get it right. Let's have a look. That one, I think. Uh, is it, though? Is it set for it? Oh, Frost, you've got yourself on camera. I didn't realize you'd done yeah. that. You never said. Hold on. We'll make. Frost! I'm here, baby. I didn't know you were there. So hang on a minute. Here's Frost, by the way. Um, we're getting brought up. There's Frosty Boy. Oh, there, look at me. He's sat fucking there all playing his game. Hello. Fun. <laughs> Having fun. Right, let's have a seat. Uh, this one, don't need that. We need this. Done. So there, that's the plex above my head. And, uh-huh. Obviously, I was looking for the Gintama earlier, but yeah. the anime is only at 954 on this server. <laughs> There's actually now more over on this server as well, which is another 99. Ignore Angel Blade. <clears throat> you did not see that. Oops. <laughs> fucking thing. Motherfucker. It's not my fault. I forgot it was fucking there. So, yeah. I Whatever. I didn't. You don't really expect Angel Blade to pop up when you just fucking go into a channel, is it? Actually, with you, me. yes. Yeah, I was, I was going to say with me. Yeah, it actually does. Match. Princess Connect Redrive. Done. But yeah, so these are just some of the animes um, that they are. So we do try our best. So. Still waiting on those movie suggestions. If you can come up with two more, I can slap them on. Slap them on. Give them a good fucking slap in. <laughs> Come on out there. Nate Sivich, the Vatsman. 
Has nobody got any ideas? I really do not. That's because you're just being fucking useless today, aren't you? Whatever. I mean, even if we don't have it, we can get it in like two minutes. <laughs> I gave a movie. <gasps> where? Where, where, where? I've forgotten it. See, bitch, give a cross. That's not that's on the movie. Oh, yeah, no. Five cents. Yeah, we got Sea Witches. She's right. Sea Witches is sat there. We've also got the points one that's used for, which is knocking on Evan's door, which is for everything. Oh, oh, lovely itch. Fuck yeah. Is Akira Kosher? No, it is not. Unfortunately, there is one fucking scene in Akira where Kaneda is chasing after Tetsuo's girlfriend and Tetsuo because they're getting attacked by a bunch of clowns. They grab her by her shirt, rip it down completely, exposing full frontal bosoms. Then they punch her in the face where she falls legs akimbo, flat on her face with the titties getting pushed out to the side. It's actually a couple of seconds, but very graphic. Much like the scene from... What's the car one again, Frost? Cow one. Redline. That's it. Okay. There's a scene in Redline, which the whole movie is completely fine. By the way, it's amazing. And then there's one scene where a woman is sat on a fucking sofa, watching the race with her titties, really gorgeously rendered in 4K. The nipples are even glistening. All that for one scene we can't play. Hum, hum, hum. Oh, yes, it's a... <sighs> oh, yes. Oh, my ding dong. It's, it's literally a fucking tremendous scene. <sighs> what sucks? Sucks! So... We're going to be sitting here and chat until we get two more movies from you. Um, I look at Frost and like, oh god, I gotta think of something so I can go. There's no I'm sleep. Here, people. As they stood there, looking into the enemy stream, there was no survivors. Oh, God, that sounds as bad as the Macho Man Randy Savage. I miss that man because he literally was, no, listen here. Completely. That guy's voice must have been shredded whenever he spoke. The amount of fucking drugs and steroids that man must have abused in his lifetime makes me jelly jealous. I mean, yeah, he probably did have a bigger Tic Tac than you anyway with your Tic Tac. You're obsessed about penises. When did you turn into fucking obsessed with cocks? You know, what's wrong with you? You turned into Alessante. The 1980s were the golden age of anime titties. Honest to God, anime titties ruled the world. But don't go to the 80s without fucking caution. Demon tentacle porn was everywhere. Disguised. Down. Disguised as normal anime as well. Fucking got me. Bastards. Grave of Fireflies. Always a choice. No, please don't. I won. It's already in the VODs anyway. So I can't anymore. I mean, that was the problem with anime in the 80s and 90s, in fact. Because of the crossover between manga and the export rate from where you could get it from, they used to actually sneak through hentai as original manga titles and they'd censor one or two bits, but not even all of it. So you'd end up with stuff like Yurotsuka Doji, um, La La Blue Girl was released to the fucking public as an actual anime. I shit you not. That was hardcore porn. It was so bad, they never even finished the series because they had to fucking cancel it. Then they brought it out, not as La La Blue Girl, but just La Blue Girl. That soon got cancelled, even though it was better animation, but the stories were still just a little bit seedy. I mean, you've got a problem. When you market an anime called La La Blue Girl, it's a ninja clan, but the ninja technique is sex. 
I don't see nothing wrong with they that. Have to, they have to dis- defeat their opponents by, and I shit you not, shagging them to death. They have trained their vaginas to clamp down and not release the target until they're not only spent, ruined, and their life force has been drained. This is probably why I don't trust women. Hey? What's so wrong with that there? Um, Well, it got a bit... It started off with normal ninjas she was fighting, and then it very quickly became demons. Mm, I still don't see... You can't even hold a straight face and say that sentence. You know it's wrong. <laughs> and then, right, then when they totally abandoned all the facade of trying to make it seem like a thing, they would actually market it as a anime in title and presentation only. And then when you started watching it, filth. That's where, and a lot of people are going to recognize this one, Black Bible came from. Black Bible had an original cover, which was a bunch of schoolgirls, and a Bible, which was all about witchcraft, and a random guy who was supposed to be abused by them. Now, a lot of people thought before it came out, abuse meant tortured and fucking things like that. No, this anime contained stuff such as hermaphrodite sex, rape scenes, fucking normal vanilla sex, and all-out satanical torture and murder. And that all came out at the age of 15s. Seriously, it had a 15 label on it. Didn't last very long, got massively banned, put into a hentai section, and then there was Black Bible Begins, Black Bible fucking pre-whatever, probably pre come knowing my fucking look, but literally, that never ended. And then from that point, the hentai genre was well and truly cemented, and there was no escaping it. So there's come in your eye. <laughs> literally. Oh, yes. So... While I've been talking about hentai and how it got into mainstream, it's a classic. (laughs) There's always one who knows it. Yes, it is. For me, right, for me, the classic hentais that are about now, there there was Black Bible, Lala Blue Girl, and Yurotsuka Doji. Those were the ones I watched. And then the more recent one, I think it was called Viper which was all about uh, 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 what we call a succubus. But I didn't really watch them. For me, it had to be a story that tricked me into it being a hentai. A classic uh, Principal Skinner Eyes Glow. <laughs> oh, dear. So, yeah, it, it, it started out with the story and then the anime divulged into giant penis sex afterwards that's what used to trick me not these ones that you get like night shift nurses it's 10 minutes into it and then somebody's getting rammed up a fucking in a doorway somewhere or irresponsible mother or the taboo twins or what was the other one kiss x kiss can you believe that's still got an anime label that's not even dubbed as hentai when you are getting Boba bores out of people's hoo-ha using a straw and playing a game with a sibling. I'm telling you now, that's hentai. I mean, the guy literally looks down at his sister, and because she's leaking juices, he sets about her with band-aids to plug her vagina. What kind of storylines do these people come up with? But anyway... Somebody give me a movie before I get completely warped on anime. Oh, dear Lord. I'm going to have to find my own sets. I said sets, not sexy perverts. <laughs> right. Uh, anime must see movies. We've got to come up with something. Uh, whisker away seen too much. Word bubble. Uh, like soda pop. No one ever felt down with him with you. Even jelly, we've done all that. Paramore. Mm, not too bad. Gundam. Is that new? That's new. The fuck is this? You have to bear with me when I find a new one. I'm like, huh? Eh? Did Cast in the Star get... 
It did. Castle in the Sky got done when we did a massive Ghibli run. We've actually done two Ghibli runs. Jesus. By audio. Why is it that Gundam is such a bitch and won't be easily done ever? Uh, multi sub is no good. Gotcha. I just kicked the side of something that was sharp and pointy. Fuck that hurt. Damn it, why is he not letting me put it in files? He just took it away at once now. Fucking computer. Okay. Any spaceship you ever talk Captain Harlock movies? We did just stream the Captain Harlock movie the other day, actually, which was the um, computer-generated one. I think that might be the only one. I've just found a nice Gundam movie. <clears throat> came out in 2021. So that might be all right. I think Frost has died in the bathroom. So hopefully it's going to be okay. Uh, yeah. So to get like a full movie down takes about three minutes. It's not a big deal. That's why I'm like asking if anyone wants anything. So yeah. You are doing well there, Vats, but the last two you've picked, we've actually streamed them both. So I can't pull them out without points. So we're best off seeing if there's anything else you want. Ah, oh, he lives. <laughs> Didn't fall in then. Yeah. No. Protein pancakes. Yeah, I know. Your fucking bowels are ruined, man. Yeah. King Forge. Bell. We already did Bell. Bell? What Bell? Yeah. The new Beauty and the Beast one? Bell? Yes, we did. It was fucking awesome, by the way. Damn. But if you had, you know, you're subscribed, you can watch it in the VOD. Yeah, Bell is actually in the VODs. Unfortunately, we can't get it out of there without points. Uh, but if you do sub to the channel, or if anybody gives you a sub for the channel, you were able we to access the VODs. And we've done Summer Wars as well. Jesus, we've done a lot. Yeah. Castle in the Sky has gotten streamed. Yeah, I did tell them. We've done all the Evangelion as well. Yes, we have. They were good and <clears throat> dubious. <laughs> that last one was so dubious. So fucking dubious. The Boy and the Beast. We've done that a few times. That's one you always go to. No, it's not. I normally go to, uh, you know, Silent Voice. That's been done <laughs> twice. You did it one week and then somebody used points on it two weeks after. It was Sea Witch that did it. <laughs> was it? Jesus. Yeah. And I was like, great choice, Sea Witch. Fuck That's you. That's one of my favorites. Just fucking had it as well, you fuck. Oh. I oh, didn't mind watching it again, to be perfectly honest. Uh, there's someone called Kyoko's Inn. When the promised flowers bloom. Oops. It was me. She's like, yeah, I did that. Fuck you, I did that. Damn right I did. I know it was you. Jesus. Yeah. And your name. Uh, we have done Moon Castle. We haven't done Wolf Children recently. We yes, have we them. have. That's in the VODs. We have okay. Uh, this looks cool. This looks like something you'd like for us. Maquin, when the promised flowers bloom. Ooh. 
Gundam Wing the movie into a small. Uh, there's a better one than that. There's a new one that just came out. You can't get better than the Indus Wall. You can. There's a new one. Stop being a fucking tard. There's mobile, um, mobile sweet Gundam. Hathaway's Flash. We haven't. I haven't seen that, and I'm not even sure if that's. It's a new one. That's what. God, I've just. I, I feel. I don't know if it's good or not. Put have you done the Persona of three movies? No, I have not. Pinoco. Ponya. Ponya. Lupin. The Lupin films have got a problem, and it's all called Fujiko. Yeah. Unfortunately, Fujiko can't keep her clothes on. At all. Not even slightly. So when it comes to Lupin films. That because we can always play the um, the live action loop in one ish. Oh wow! Oh no! Oh, it's a guy. It's a girl in there. Let's check it. Oh, covered. Covered still. The art style on this is fucking beautiful. It's like old, yet still fresh. Voices in the voices of a distant star. I'm a bead. Novi's Island. Garden of Sinners. Actually, that was pretty good, but nothing that we could probably play. <sighs> Still going through this for fucking nudity. Well, there's some close scenes which keeps them covered, so that's all right. And I'm putting that in because it looks good. But what audio is it in? On your track, English as well. Fuck yeah, get on. Get on, he says. Get on. There's a recent one called Stranger by the Shore. I haven't seen it, but it, I've seen clips online and it looked good. But I checked though, just to be safe. Not a problem. Give me a moment. Stranger by the Shore. <laughs> um, I grab that one. No, I was looking at it and I was going to get it. Two seconds. Boom. Wash. I'm it. We were just talking about this the other day. George. What? It's friggin'. Yeah, but this. Um, I've got the series. No, I've got the movie, but the series isn't out yet. Right. Well, that's what we were. Uh, the movie any good? Can't be played, I don't think. Um, it's a violent thing. The actual Spriggan movie is completely different to the series that's coming out anyway. Yeah. I'm, I'm still seeing about it because I've never seen it. So. Yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, God, that's another new one. Jeez, yeah. Do you want to just um, check Stranger by the Shore for us, see if you can find nudity in it or not? Please. Are you able to, or are you playing the game? Uh, sorry, I forgot to ask. Ooh, well, uh, four. Come on. 
Google now. Sweet, thank you very much. So I found two more. I'm getting them now. Um, I'm literally just adding a bunch of movies into the stream now. So we're going to have a load of movies play. Why not? We've had a fucking huge series. So anyone out there with suggestions for movies, I can't qualify when they're going to be coming in order. The only one that's first is Cowboy Bebop because it was used for points. That's a huge nope. Why? Content warning. Explicit set scenes. Nope. That's my new pervert. What, for The Stranger by the Beach, 2020? Yeah, it's Stranger by the Shore, uh, 2020. Content what? warning. Explicit sex scenes. Shit. It, it doesn't even say anything. You motherfucker. What? Really? This is a BL fucking boys love fucking anime movie. With an explicit sex scene. Well, he didn't know. He said it was a new one he was thinking about watching. Oh, oh, okay. 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 Sure. Look, some people don't know what it is. That's why we're here, remember? It's not like he, it's not like he asked us to put piano in the forest on, is it? Um, top tags in this movie. BL, drama, romance, yaoi. Uh, y- yaoi? Yaoi means no boy love. Death by of a loved one and uh, mu- uh, mature romance, sexual scenes, orphans, and based on a manga. Okay, well don't put any spoilers out because the guy might still want to watch it for his boy love. We don't know. We don't yeah, judge I here. Just, I just read the tags. That's all I did. <laughs> but the worst thing is I've still I've I've still installed it into the server. Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> What's that piano one? The piano one is hell. The piano one is uh no. <laughs> it's called Piano in the Forest, and I won't play it even if a fucking supermodel told me she was gonna fucking suck my dick. I don't care if we have a million points put on the channel; it would not get played. It's one that we all hate equally. Oh, why, why did I pick that up? Was this it? Was this the other one? Oh, this is that one. Yeah, this one's cool. Pretty nice. Is that a dragon? Oh, wow, that's an armored dragon. That's nice. That's a bone dragon. There's a new Sailor Moon movie. Fuck you. I mean, oh, is there? Oh, look, see which enjoyed Piano in the Forest. That's because you hate me, isn't it? <laughs> okay, if you like the music, put it on a CD and just go listen to it off in a quiet a corner why you know it's not on the anime channel stranger by the beach let's have a look at this fucking travesty then here we go yowie boy love ooh ooh that actually looks turn the fuck back on this must be a different film. There's no sex in this one. It says explicit sex scenes. I know, I'm looking for it now. Why are you looking for it? Because I have to check the anime. Alright, I got one for you to look up. Wait a minute, I'm still looking this one up. Oh, it nearly made it to the end of the anime then. It nearly made it. Holy shit! (laughs) There's a scene where he's putting a condom on the guy's cock. Um, It doesn't show it, but it shows enough of it. See, he gets the condom out 
they're sat locked in each other's legs, and every time it goes to like them doing something, it cuts to a pair of cow cat. Oh my god, he's on his front. There was a picture of lube. Yeah, he's getting ridden from behind. You can see the pain in his face as his friends slowly thrust him behind him. Yeah, we can't show this. We we can't show this. It doesn't show anything, but the implications are close enough with what it does show. It would get yeeted off Twitch. My God, my God. I I I I I, I damn. <laughs> God, God damn. God damn. What's that viewport? What's Princess Principal Crown? What were you put that for? Yeah. That's a new movie. This came out this. Uh... Okay, I'll see if we can grab it. Oh uh, no, no, it's all right, Vance man. That just gave me a fucking right laugh. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, mate. Wow. <laughs> You see, that's why we have the mods, and that's why I'm never on here on my own when we're doing this. It had a surprise at the end. Honestly, I've never seen an anime that that that, that shows how to put a fucking condom on with graphic fucking instructions. Bong. Or should I say, patoing. My lordy lord. Mm hmm. Right. So look at this. So we've got one, two, three, four, five films so far. Cowboy Bebop knocking on heaven's door. Five centimeter per second. Mobile suit Gundam Hathaway Flash. One that I can't pronounce because it's a bit fucking long, but it's a good one. And I have stuck at the end because it will run after everything else when we finish doing this. Is Gintama the final? So all you Gintama fans out there, there's a surprise after all the movies. But we're getting some more movies on first. We're putting a couple of movies on, because why the fuck not? We haven't had a movie like Marathon for a while. Okay. So I apologise for all you people out there who are just wanting endless anime. But, you know, we have to take the time to engage with you all and find stuff that you're going to like, whether you want us to or not. <laughs> uh, it's only available in sub, my friend. You still want it? Mark calling Orson. Come in, Orson. Oh, well, no, no. I was telling you to check it out. I'm checking out three more that uh, I found new movies recently. So I was going to ask you to check that one out. Hey, sure, that's not a series. There's two of them. Uh, from what I've seen, it's supposed to be a movie, and they're going to come out with more later. Oh, I just found it in dual audio as well. I'm so, not sure if it's good or not. Or well, not one sure. movie's already out, and it looks like they've released the second one. Uh, yeah, just this year. So the first one came out in 2021, and the second one's just come out in 2022. That is not... Movie that is a OVA. So the files already exist in the destination folder. Okay, we've already got this. Really? Yep. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I set up a thing so if it was already in the server, the server tells us now instead of putting it in for no reason. I'll have a look in a second. Let's check this one out as well. Ah, uh, it's raw. Well, there's a new Sword Art Online movie, apparently. Does it have to be? Yep. I don't want there to be. Sword Art Online has turned garbage for some fucking time now. Mobile Suit Gundam Hathaway. It's a nice audience store and that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for actual content. Wait, is Forest of Piano and Piano in the Forest the same show? Yes. yes. If it's anything with Forest and Piano in the same name, we're not doing it. <laughs> I would rather bend over and let you shiv my asshole with a giant stick. 
I'd rather take a bullet in the kneecap and walk around. No, no, no. I'd rather take an arrow to the knee. <laughs> I'm just doubting myself as a massive nerd, haven't I? Shit. Oh, it's not that bad. If you're a girl, it's not that bad. With a vagina that bleeds once a month. I'm just checking out the new movies from 2021. No, honestly, Piano in the Forest, all joking aside, is a tremendous movie and series to sit down and watch with a significant other or a girlfriend you're trying to subdue into liking anime before you whip her panties off and have a jolly good time. Because the storyline of that series is so bad, you don't actually have to watch it. I mean, a girl probably would, but I wouldn't. The music is actually exquisite all the way through the series. The movie is solid for the, the audio. The actual concerts when the pianos are all being used in concertos and stuff is really, really, really good. Can't stress that enough. But that's not why I watch an anime. I watch an anime to see someone's titties get pulled out and someone gets slaughtered, beheaded, and in some other way, buggered to death by something weird. That's why I watch anime. I'm a big fan of stuff like Made in the Abyss. I was raised, as I've said many times, on Yuroxigodoji, which is why I'm probably wrong in the head. The Deer King, the fuck is that? That's a new movie and it looks wonderful. Ew. Does it now? It does, actually. I just watched the preview for it. it it's all types of old school. Could the title be any fucking longer? Uh, do you want it to be from the kid from the last dungeon comes to the Boonie Towns? Man, I didn't say it was a fucking competition. Right, I can't find that. You'd probably give me a bum name. That's what it's I don't know. Yeah, you have. I'm giving you a bum name. That's the last survivor of a band of warriors. Oh, no, that's something else. It's just called the Deer King. The Deer King, the promised journey with Yuna. That's what it comes up for me. Wow, it's not out yet. Are you sure it's out? It says it's out. I do not find it. Um, as it came out 2021, 2022, so. Yeah, you might want to check DVD releases. It's not out yet. It hasn't been released. It came out in the cinema. Did you hear me? Yeah, when did it come out in the cinema then? 2021. Nope. You're only fucking salty because you liked it. Well, the original soundtrack... It's still being run in cinemas as well, though. Really? Uh-huh. How is it still being run in cin- That is... Okay. I must have gotten some real good reviews then. Well, how long did fucking um, Eugen Train stay in fucking cinemas for? You know what I mean? That was there for a while. It came out October. Mm hmm. Jesus. Fucking 8 gig takes 4 minutes to download now? That's ridiculous. So, while we're sitting here, um, there's a couple of people that keep coming and going, coming and going. There's 24 of you in there. We are looking for suggestions for movies. So, if you're going to sit there and look, that's totally fine. We respect your choice to say fuck all. 
But you can't bitch about what anime we put on. If you mention something, and even though we can't put it on, then you can bitch all you want because you tried to help. Oh my god. I told people not to bitch about what's kept coming on and they just left. Peace out. Okay, bitches, I'm gone. Oh, my vagina hurts. He put sand in it. <laughs> Movie status finished aired. Oh. Do you know what the best thing about this channel is? Apart from all the anime. It's the fact that nobody stays here as a snowflake. They literally leave because they can't handle what we're like. All right, so... It says it came out in October mm -hmm. 2021, but it says it aired February 4th, 2022. Yeah, no, in cinemas, right? No, telecom. Well, that's not, that only gives you a shitty copy anyway. Well, you can't have it. We're not coming it. You can I'm fuck looking. off. You can look all you want. You can't find shit. You know I normally find shit if I want to. Not anime, you can't. Not as good as me. I'll ask Wolf tomorrow. Wolf can't find it as good as me either. How, how many years was he looking for that series it took me ten minutes to find? Two years. Whatever. Well, you know. Fuck it. <laughs> mm. Right now, I am getting tired, so I'm going to run off very shortly. Unless people can come up with an anime, because I was going to bed two hours ago. See how well that went down. <laughs> I'm so fucking useless to go to sleep when I'm meant to. By the way, if anyone who wants to try and get to watch that uh, bell, I would recommend it. It was really good. Get yourselves in the VODs. Uh, we've done Whisker Away multiple times. Have we done Over the Sky? I don't think we have. Uh, no, not really. Fuck you and getting my goddamn hopes up, motherfucker. Oh, shit. It's a movie that Crunchyroll did. Yep. The Deer King. Yep, yep. That's nice, so I can probably get it pretty easily. No, you can't. It does come out when it does come out. I cried, I cried a bunch at Bell. Well, that's just out in you as a bigger nerd than me. No, it was good. It's a retelling of Beauty and the Beast done through anime, and it made an amazing series. Massively impactful for the art style and the overall story. It was done fucking phenomenally, and I would recommend it to anyone as well. It was a very good movie, yes. I will say that very much. So it was a very good movie. I liked it. Mm. I mean, don't get me wrong, we go through a lot of anime on this channel and we do talk about a lot of anime, but in all fairness, when we find something that's good, we tell you it's good, and if we find out it's shit, we're, we don't exactly pull any punches. Get on. Oh yeah, he gets, on. he gets shit on hard. <laughs> it's like, that's why I wouldn't say anything about Gintama, it wasn't my sort of thing, it wasn't Frost's sort of thing, but people in the channel did enjoy it. I personally like to understand what the fuck's going on when I put my balls in a blender. Gintama stopped all that, so I wasn't enjoying it. 
<laughs> Plus, there was so much I reading. I just came up after a while. So much reading as well. It made no sense, and I was expected to read the nonsensicalness. I'm like, my entire brain was like. <laughs> <laughs> down the hole. Uh, is bubblegum crisis on the table it is for us, um, a series but at the moment we're only looking for movies bubblegum crisis bubblegum crash they're all very long seasons uh, I don't mind putting them on but mm, so much mayonnaise <laughs> not the mayonnaise god damn so much mayonnaise, you thought you were at a pukkake party, eh, Sivich? Yeah, what's going on with mayonnaise? It was a big thing in the show. But you didn't watch it, so you wouldn't know. Why? Ooh! Anyone got any sticks? Okay, um... Mm. I'm just grabbing over the sky now. And then once this is done, we can head towards bed, I think. Good, because you and me are... Yeah, I like Kintama enough to focus consistently on the subs. That's good, then. I mean, it's nice that people enjoyed it, and I'm really happy about that. That's why we try and aim on this channel to put more of the eclectic anime on that people wouldn't normally stream. Because, one, that's what we want. Two... It's nice to see good shit. And three, I really want to play fucking Outlaw Star in HD. Fuck you, can't stop it. Fuck off. But it looks so fucking good. It is so fucking good, but shut up. Oh, come on. Wolf will never know. I have the DVD box set special edition of Outlaw Star. We, I, I won't tell Wolf. Fuck off. You won't tell Wolf. Yes, I will. Grass. Snitches get stitched, bitch. No, I don't fucking care. Fly the fuck over here. No, you've got guns. <laughs> You're fucking weird. <laughs> you've got enough armaments in your house to hold off a fucking small army. I'm not coming around there with me baseball bat from England. <laughs> <laughs> What baseball bat? Oof. Yeah, isn't it? Fucking bullshit. I need some sort of baseball bat that fires a rocket out of the end of it. God damn. Knock, knock, motherfucker. Door explodes. Uh, I'll just do like they did on Red and shoot the, the RPG. God. <laughs> Jesus. I'm going to explore her. Boom, boom, dig it home. Right. Okay, so we're on the sky. Going to check this now. Fucking jeez. Uh, this one's a bog standard, normal, boring anime. Fucking star art style. Typical thing with demons and schoolgirls. And something that looked like a Yoda for no reason. Okay, that's it. Right, last time I'm asking the channel, anyone have any anime movies they want? Going <sighs> once, going twice, not asking again. There we go. Sold! End of bidding. Ding, 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 ding. Close the Wall Street Journal. Get the fuck out of out here. Let's go. Mm. So we've added a couple of brand new animes to the files, which we've just done now, which is awesome, by the way. Uh, there's not else you need to check for them for us before we go. No, no other new ones. I, I I already checked most of the other new ones. I thought were anime movies. They were OVAs. I could not play them. Mm. Uh, the one I did find, which said it came out, didn't actually come out, and then was pushed back, but actually aired, but didn't actually air yet. Yeah. Uh, because I look for the, the Deer King still. Apparently, it still hasn't aired yet. Nope. Don't you? But it says it has in like three different times. That happens a lot, though. Come on, let's be honest, you know? That happens. All right, so 
Ah, before we go, here's the upcoming playlist of movies then. The other shows have remained unchanged. So, we have got Cowboy Bebop knocking on Heaven's Door. 5 centimeter per second. Mobile Suit Gundam Hathaway Flash. Sayori no Ashi ni Yokizo no Juana wa Kawazaho. Jesus Christ. Over the... <laughs> nope, that's far too racist to me. I do apologize. <laughs> <laughs> Egg for a young beef fried Chinese rice. I don't know what the fuck it means. Over the sky, and then finishing with Gintama the final. Where are you going with Egg Young? <sighs> mm. <Fucking> young. <laughs> Anything over 18 is fair game in the UK. You can shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, so. That's the movies that are set to run. I hope you all have a good time, especially starting off with Cowboy Bebop. It is a classic. If you have not seen it before, it is worth watching. Right, Frost. Honestly, yeah. no more movies? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm done. Bid them all good night then, and I shall kick myself out of Discord and we'll get it all sorted. Good night, all y'all people in the anime nerdy nurse. I take it you're actually going to be heading to bed now as well then, Frost? Yes. Right, well, I will bid you a good night as well, and I won't pop back in Discord because I'm going to head to bed itself. Sweet dreams, okay. my man, and I'll see you later on tomorrow night, okay? Night. Night, night. <laughs> right, Frosty, my boy, is gone. He is now in bed. Well, he'll be on his way to bed. To all you late-night anime people and the people who want to slay there and just watch a go about anime as you go to bed, we've got some more coming up for you. So... Have a wonderful evening, have a great afternoon, and a stupendous morning. It is best thing in the fucking morning for me. I am going to make myself a cup of tea, go and put <laughs> Cowboy Bebop on, lay in bed, and hopefully pass the fuck out for a good couple of hours. Now remember, if anything goes wrong with the stream, at the side of my head is this. Send a message in the Discord, it goes off like a fucking rocket, and it will wake me up and I'll be able to come in and fix the anime. By all means, do not sit there and go, uh, Hello, I need an adult supervision. Because this screen I can't see while I'm in bed. I can only see the chat from Discord because that's set up with the extra alarms. So if you need an adult, use the adult app known as Discord. Send us a message and I'll go, You fucking shit. And I'll walk my way in here, bouncing off every single wall in the house to come and sort out the anime. And then I'll go, I'm going to bed now. No, no. And then I'll just wander back off and try and get some sleep. So, take care, have fun, and as always, I'll see you guys again later. Alright? Good night. <laughs>
but we have no idea how long that's going to last. No, no, none whatsoever. Oh, right. So, where do we start? Holy shit. We have had a massive run of movies over the evening and the early hours of the morning. At least it was for me. Um, in America, I suppose you guys wouldn't have had much sleep because it had been the early hours of the morning to the earlier hours of the morning. Um, I think it's now, yep, it's going on towards the evening for me. Yay! And I started all the movies while it was the morning, which is just complete fuckery. So, where did we start? Yes, I saw Bebop. We started off with Cowboy Bebop knocking on Heaven's Door, which was a beautiful pick. Uh, I personally kind of like it, but it also kind of spoils the series. So if you watch the movie, does it come before, does it come after? It's a bit of a limbo thing that kind of pisses me off. But in all fairness, they gave me more Cowboy Bebop, so I give it a good 8 out of 10. I can't give it any more than that because of the confusion between the series and the movie. And... That in itself makes me sad. Now, I'd love that it'd be more Bebop. Never going to happen. Uh, Netflix has already violated the memory of it with the live action. And anyone who hasn't seen the live action, I urge you with all sincerity, do not fucking watch it. The director decided he was going to take his own way with the series while still trying to put in as many nods to the original anime as possible. And what actually happened was he bent over the literal corpse of the Bebop crew and ass raped them to fucking death. If that wasn't bad enough, he made Ed sit in the back filming it. And why in the back? Because he didn't show up to the last episode and he thought we'd be okay with that. Well, I'm not okay. I feel like I was touched by a dis-fucking-vantaged uncle who wouldn't get off me and now I'm in a shame shower. Rocking violently... Until I can find relief. That's what you did to me Netflix. And you should feel ashamed. But anyway. Enough about that. <laughs> mm. yeah. After that was. Five centimeters per second. A goddamn beautiful anime. Which was far too fluffy for me. To continue watching. I had to go in a corner. Before I had a. An episode, shall we say. Yes. All the sweetness and caringness made me think I was going to end up hypoglycemic. In the middle of some sort of sugar shock right in the back. <laughs> no, no. Honestly, it was a good anime if you liked it. The artwork was stunning. The overall storytelling was very, very pleasant. But it was one for the ladies. So I'm going to give it a good 9 out of 10 if you want to get laid. A 4 out of 10 for keeping me interested. So that one... The next one. Ooh, we need someone in here like Wolf, unfortunately, for this. Because I am not going to be nice. Was Mobile Suit Gundam Hathaway Flash. The Flash in the title, I am pretty sure, is due to the animation style of the wannabe three-dimensional characters in computer-generated bullshit. It's as if they just abducted a small fucking intern from a local graphic studio somewhere and said... Here's Flash. Who's Flash? Don't worry about it. Just make a fucking monster. And literally, they ruined the entire series. The animated parts that were hand-drawn were actually not bad. But unfortunately, they were few and far between. So I had to suffer with the Flash anime style. Yeah, I'd rather smash my own testicles in with a brick. It was very worrying. Good morning, good evening, and hello. Well, nothing for me. You sound like you dragged yourself out of a fucking hedge. God damn. I'd urge you to put your camera on, but you don't sound like you fought already. You definitely have a face for radio right now. <laughs> oh. My God, you did it all. There's that beautiful face for radio we were talking about. Give us a smile, you sexy beast. <laughs> you like Luna. Mm. All right, so, nom nom nom. I'm chewing a sweet, which actually makes my throat moist. Too much cock down it from all these dodgy animes. So, after Mobile Suit Gundam, uh -huh. this is where it gets a bit fucking freaky. 
What? We're playing Gundam? No, we played it earlier. It was a movie. Oh. Don't worry. The animation would done with a flash video player. It was fucking terrible. Hmm. Trying to work out what the fuck. Oh my god, I've just made fucking three shortcuts. What's wrong with me? Are you petting the dog? Are you happy again now with the dog? Well, you can't hold it against her. She doesn't know what she's done wrong. Stop being a dick. Oh, okay. In that case, yeah, put her back in the cage. The last one other than that was Marky the Promised Flower Blooms. Interesting anime. The art style was definitely something to be desired, as in it wasn't bad. Uh, it was in a fantasy setting, which I liked, but I fell asleep and couldn't get through it because it was pretty and it sounded nice and it fucking rocked me to sleep. So that's one I can't really quote on. Um, it was just a lovely fantasy setting with a very nice tale, and I just went... <laughs> now, you've got to give me credit. At that point, it was literally about fucking 10 o'clock in the morning. I'd been awake for two days. And I just couldn't handle it. Okay, I'm a snowflake. My body's weak, but the mind was willing. So, it's in the vaults. I, myself, am going to go back and watch it at some point. Because I haven't fucking seen all of it. What I did see of it was nice. Without knowing the full extent of the story, and for legal purposes, I'm going to give it a 5 out of 10. Because I have to. But I can't really say whether it was worth watching or not. If you like pretty, well hand-drawn anime... Give it a go. The art style alone made me want to see more. Now then, the last one. Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. I actually woke up halfway through Over the Sky. I was not a fan. It's one of the Frost favourites, I think. That's something he would have enjoyed. Schoolyard bullshittery. Not my sort of thing at all. It was an anime that was just on um, called... Over the sky, it was very similar to, um, you know, the anime tropes in school where they fall in love and they're all happy and they're all dancey and they're all thingy and they're loving and they're... Somebody kill me. It's fucking grim, mate. Grim. It's a great panty dropper, not a short stopper. So I wouldn't recommend it. I'd give it a 5 out of 10. Could have been learnt worse, but it had the panty dropper ability, so it gets a higher marking. And last, but not least, but at least it is last... And also the final, which is said in the title, thank God, was, that's right, Gintama. I have had enough Gintama to fill my ass crack if it was fucking the Grand Canyon. So, Gintama finished. I understand absolutely nothing of that anime. Every single time I looked at it, my brain melted more than the first time. One minute, it was running credits. Next minute, there was more anime. And then... In the intro, when it started, a long time ago, a man eats a fucking Dragon Ball ripoff, right down to the fucking meter he had in his hand, and then there were samurais, and then there was... Somebody explain this to me, and I know I sound loud and shouty, because I'm angry. Why was two old men crawling out of the arse of the giant dog? What? Anybody who watched Gintama knows what I'm talking about. Two... Men, grown and adult in nature, crawled out of the giant white doggy's arse crack like they was in a sauna. What the fuck, man? He ate them. He ate them? What? They came out like they'd just been on a fucking safari to a resort somewhere. Ah, yes, that spa treatment was bloody marvellous. I had no idea what was going on. Honestly, it was like I'd taken a handful of LSD... And I'd gone out for a night with Johnny Depp on the tiles. I didn't know my arse was my elbow, my elbow was my ass. It was insane. They should have brought that out as Fear and Love in Las Vegas 4. Because that's how much sense it made. Oh, God. It's just, 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 I'm, I'm so happy Kintama's done. I am. I need sanity in my life. I need sanity, Frost! So yeah, I cannot give Gintama a rating because I don't know what I watched. So I put that out there to the two most virulent people in the channel that watched it, Sevich and Spectre John. I expect a review from both of you. 
Tell us a little bit about what you thought and please give it a rating out of 10. I will shut the fuck up and wait because I need assistance to understand what you guys liked in it because I haven't got a clue. And to keep me quiet... Yeah, it was it was fucking weird, mate. It was so weird. Uh. So, since you are conscious at this time, are you wanting out an hour to get yourself together before we try and kill things on gears or what? No, Doyle rules. Now then, um, you give it a ten out of ten. What the fuck is your reasoning? Oh my good fucking god! Yeah, you better have this. Thing. I need an explanation. Fuck, I need a whole paragraph. What the crap? <laughs> Did he just join the cell? I hope so. Yes. I'm literally on bated breath. I'm not even going to say it while you speak. There we go. Okay. I have myself muted. <laughs> <laughs> but, okay, but yeah, I, love, I gave it a 10 out of 10 because it's, it's been one of my favorite animes. Like, I can go back to it every time. And it, because it's like a parody of almost every popular anime that was out from pretty much the 90s to now. Like, it made fun of Naruto, he had Tiny Dragon Ball, One Piece, like everybody, Gundam, everybody's in there. But also it has the kind of classic set of like Cowboy Bebop where there's a big giant arc, but then there's individual little little bitty arcs that really if you look at just individual episodes, it doesn't look like it means anything. But each individual little arc in Gintama, just like in uh, Cowboy Bebop or even in uh, Trigun and things like that, each one adds maybe like one or two extra characters, but also develops more of the relationship from the main characters through the rest of the story. And, uh, so I always like that little piece too, because like at first it's just like, you know, Gintama and then, you know, uh, Shinpachi and Kagura, but then they add on and then brings in Shinpachi's sister and then brings in the police force that's obsessed with the sister and, you know, the one that has the uh, Zoro's voice actor for the police. So just keep on adding on the all the <laughs> So, and then on top of that, like, they don't take themselves seriously at all. Like, they keep on saying, like, hey, we're about to be canceled. And they actually did, but then they keep, they keep on getting brought back, and then they just keep on making fun of the country to keep on bringing them back. So I'm saying, like, the, uh, if you had to, the current, you know, animation, like, uh, Family Guy, how they got canceled, but then they came back and became a cult favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! Honestly, because I only watched one or two episodes, that was fucking lost on me. I was like, the entire time through it, I ain't gonna fucking clear what was going on. It was like I was taking liquid meth every fucking time I looked at it. It was like, yeah, no! Like, you just watch like one of the episodes and you switch each time, you're like, what are they talking about? And, you know, just like watching like Super Milk Chan or, uh, like, like if you just come in in the middle of the episode, you're going off. I'll give you that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is, but that's what I you actually have to actually watch it, or like if you actually read the manga and you saw each individual chapter where you know what they're doing in the chapters, you, you know, you can, you can follow along with it. Uh, no, you've literally just explained to me why the anime is a cult favorite, because for a person like yourself and obviously Seawidge, you two will have watched the hell out of that, right, while it was on? Yeah. Right. So, you caught every one of the little nuances, all the little jokes, which is why you kept saying mayonnaise the entire time, and Frosty's like, what are you on about with mayonnaise? And <laughs> yeah. I now understand why Gintama's not shown on other streams, 
because nobody's going to watch it all who doesn't know what the fuck it is. Holy shit! Yeah. Fuck yeah, like what are they doing? Holy crap, man. Right. Well, I have you here as well. For your birthday, I do still owe you an anime. Now, then, you said 88, but did you mean Area 88 or did you actually mean 86? Because 86 is second season or part two hasn't been dubbed yet. That's what I was about to say. I saw I was talking about Area eighty eight, but also I remember I mentioned uh, eighty six before too. too. Uh, I like that one. Well, which one would? No, th- I tried to find it in. They've only done the first half in dub. So, do you still want eighty eight for your birthday? Because it's your birthday yeah. thing. So. Yeah, we can do the Area eighty eight. Okay. okay, let me see if I can find that. I don't know if it's in my server or not, but it won't take me a minute to to get. So, um. Mm-hmm. 88. Oh, is it only an OVA? That seems... Oh, that's Frost. <laughs> that's funny as fuck. Frost, you're a bitch. <laughs> you know the anime you got off me? And I thought I got all my anime back, yeah? <laughs> I've just scanned for Area 88. It's like, oh, yeah, you've got that. It's on the fucking hard drive I sent to you, which is now in America. But it's not on mine. mine. (laughs) (laughs) I've got super internet. I'll just get it back. Give me a minute or two. (laughs) Oh, that's fucking ridiculous. Yeah, because we've now linked a load of Plex servers all up together. So another another bonus, if you are in the um, Discord, give us a shout out to get added to the Plex. Because if you've got a Plex either on your PC or on your laptop or whatever, you can access these servers we've got and watch stuff anytime, anywhere. See, I thought about doing that because I actually built a, uh, a home server. It's actually in my upstairs room. It's my old gaming de- uh, desktop. And I've been using that as a home server. Hmm. It's worth doing, honestly. It really is. Yeah. There it is. All right. Grab that. Job done. When you get like mine is basically the same. You still finding shit that you don't have. Yeah. Um. Over a year ago, before I stopped my channel for about a year, and uh, a lot of my friends took over, my hard drive literally died frost sent over a hard drive from america which i cloned the entirety of my anime on because i did say if anyone sent over a hard drive from america i would give them the entire contents of anime that i owned he was the only person who did it so i literally gave him all the anime i had without any problem at all and he was like oh thank you very much the day we shipped it back my hard drive died completely i lost Everything. I think it was about 10 terabytes of anime gone. And obviously I'd sent the hard drive back to America, so I couldn't use any of the files I'd given him. So I had to wait until it arrived in America, and we sat down trying to match up lists of what I had found while it was traveling to what I was missing so we could add them back onto the server. I'll tell you now, it was a mistake that I wish I'd never made. And I do now have backups. <laughs> mm. I'm gonna have to do that too. Uh, mm. oh, I'm, uh, be careful because when you send shit over there, it, uh, they fucked me. They fucked me hard. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. So. I've seen stuff over there before, right? And this one is the one where, uh, like, it's all on you. The the shipping, the import fees, everything is on you. So you have to send them money to get the import shit done. Now, their import shit 
Hey, I sent you the spot. You got receipts of everything. I kept nothing. I got nothing for doing it. Yeah, no, no. That, that, that's my question. It's all on you, though. But it was 58 pounds. It was $78 for import fee. Mm. <laughs> she can smell you having fun. <laughs> All right, okay, that's that's unsettled. How much anime did you get, bitch? A lot. More than seventy-eight pounds worth of anime. I'm just saying the fact that Doctor was able to sing something over and not get import fees. Yeah, yeah, he sent over that giant fucking um, amazing yeah, blanket. blanket. Yeah, it's awesome. And I sent over a like pound and a half little. Uh, you got fucked. You got fucked hard. Right, so we're just getting Area 88 down now, which is no VA. Um, it will be in dual audio. It's going to take about 10 minutes, so we're at least going to be sat here in chat for 10 minutes, um, which is a good thing. We all get to spend a bit of time together. Aww. So is there any anime that people are looking forward to seeing uh, that is out and you'd like us to acquire, or any shows that you're really looking forward to that you wish we'd played and we haven't got round to yet? If you say what I think you're going to say, I'm going to eat you. What am I going to say? No, no. I'm not helping you. I'm not helping you. I mean, looking forward to time, yeah. That's okay. That's fine. Okay, okay. I can handle that. That's good. I didn't think that was getting a season two. I can't believe it's got a season two. Yeah. Yes, it is. There's not really any anime I'm looking forward to. The ones that I want have already started now. Oh, actually, no. You just told me that Goblin Slayer is coming back. So I am looking forward to that. That's one I am looking forward to. There was another one that you were looking forward to. Mm -hmm. Oh, episode three of Shield Heroes out. Jizz, jizz, jizz. I mean, yay. <laughs> hmm. Chainsaw Man. Yes, Chainsaw Man. Chainsaw Man should be good. No, that's not what I care about. That's what you care about because, you know, it's Izaki Chan and I think she's a little bitch. Uh, Man, she, she's a blue ball inciting fucking cock goblin. That's what she is. He doesn't know anything. <laughs> needs to fucking learn. Fucking giving everyone blue balls. What's it like? In high school, you know, when the girls, like, they, get, they uh, get puberty and they don't understand what happened. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I think personally it's wrong. She needs to sort of shit out and stop giving everyone the blue balls. It's not very fair. There's men out there that are just so broken and she's like, oh, let's go play. I forgot about this one and I told you this one was coming out next. Season two. Mm, which one? Season two. I didn't forget about that. It's called Positive Denial because I can't have it yet. Devil is a part timer. Season two. No, that's one that you like. I don't care about that. Overlord season four. Nope. Yeah, Shield Heroes just episode three just came out today. Not that I'm really, 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 really wanting to watch them, but I mean, episode three came out today. It's not, I thought that were done. I didn't think there was any more Doctor Stone coming out. Don't watch it. You might as well just play the game. Which game does it go through? One, two, and uh, one and two, and a start of three. I think it is. Okay. But the games are much more betterer. 
<laughs> yeah, I'd recommend the games over the anime. I mean, the anime is a nice concept, but the game, it's very, very good is Shemu the game. I mean, all right, the first two are very... Remember when Sega used to have the sketchy anime where everyone was like very jerky and movement was basically a stick up their ass? Yeah, I mean, you know, it was Dreamcast. Yeah, if, yeah, Dreamcast, exactly. If you can get over that, it's a great game to play. It's like a uh, semen game and then uh, Sonic Adventures. <laughs> Sonic Adventures was a nightmare. Sonic Adventures 2 was actually really good. Yeah, that was And then Sonic Heroes. Yeah, they're making another series for uh, the, the girl. And Ooh. this one gets a spin-off of uh, Iron-Blooded Orphans. Oh, God. <laughs> mm-hmm. Bear with me. I am literally moving files around that I just found. It would I would not be putting Shield Hero Episode 3 into a file. That's how I got reincarnated. <laughs> I reckon the next big series that we'll have, uh, the, well, the next big movie that everyone wants is most definitely um, the didn't oh fuck is it the Titan uh, Titan Zero thing. Oh, did two Titan yeah. Some fucking person is on the server watching him Macbeth. I didn't even know I had that. I've got some weird shit. No, it's um, Lindsay the Stalker. Oh, No, I just got it in sub yesterday, all of it. I'm trying to warm myself up to it because the animation seems even more computer generated ish so I have to get ready for it. Mm. We are 20 seconds away from Area 88, the OVA. The demon girl next door? Mm -hmm. The new spring that I was talking about. Excellent. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm actually waiting for the executioner to play it live. To actually watch that. It's up to three episodes now, isn't it? Yeah, no, I'm waiting for the Skeleton War uh, Skeleton Knight in Another World to finish. That's uh, one that I'm actually quite enjoying. It's as close to... No, sorry, go on. The one that I actually have uh, liked the most this season so far is the, uh, the dating game. I watched it. I didn't mind it, but I need to see more of it in a long run. It's not something I can be interested in enough to sit there per episode. I'm just not. Yeah. It's a little bit like standing on a million lives sort of thing. If you can't binge it, it's not worth it. No, people, it's not actually a dating show game. It's him throwing a card or something. The easy way of explaining it, because he did a shit job, is you are a background character inside a dating sim, and you wish to become a main character. But you've already played the dating sim, so you can fuck with the main characters and get what you want. So that's his way of finding out what's going on. Which is why I couldn't watch any more than that, and I have to watch it in a binge. Because the interestingness is in the twisting of the nature. I hope he murders somebody. Okay, we have got one, two, three, four, five episodes of Area 88. Are you sure, Spectre, this is what you want? Yeah, I can't think of anything else unless you want to do, uh, I can't keep up a good day, but Terraformers. <laughs> I'd rather plat piss. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> honestly, I'd rather dive face first into a sandpit made of my own feces. Uh, no, 
Oh. I'm taking your first answer, and you can wait for Terraformers till probably next time you use points, which I know you will do now. God damn it! <laughs> right. Oh, you savage bastard! <laughs> It was, good, it was it was computer generated fuckery and you know it. I know I tell you something, if you if you actually use points on that, Wolf would love you forever. <laughs> Giant kaijus and fucking mech warriors, oh my god. Yeah. They even brought out Ultraman Taro. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the only part about Ultraman I liked was the giant Ultraman lady with the giant huge boobs of plenty. Other than that, I was confused and weirdly abandoned. <laughs> Very strange. That's not unnormal for you. No, sir, it is not. I spend my life in that normal, natural state. I spend your life in that confused. I don't understand what's going on. What the hell was that? Oh, crap. Yeah, because it's kind of true. Oh, God, honestly, I've just, I just brought up Season 2, Episode 1 to 6, and the very first image that, like, literally starts for that is a computer-generated smiley man that looks like he belongs in a badly rendered Saturn game, and I don't want to watch it. But I'll add it to the list. Oh, sadness. So much sadness. Uh, where's Season 2, 1? Um... Oh, God, there's a live-action series. <laughs> that sounds terrible. <laughs> Ultraman Nexus, it's called, and there's Ultraman Tiger, or Tegra. I mean, Ultraman always been live-action. Oh, God, my soul hurts. Only from, like, the, the 60s. There's a reason it was in the 60s, and happily I was not born then. <laughs> Which I... I think it's still... I don't know if it's still running right now, but there's been a series forever. Oh, God, it makes me sad. <laughs> Fuck. Rider and Power Rangers, or I guess... Next, you're going to pop out the Beetle Bogs, aren't you? Power Rangers, Beetle Bogs. I don't like Beetle Bogs, but I watched the Cyber Cyber Squad. Oh, God. I'm going to get Oh, God, if you want to talk about toys, get on a wolf again. He'll be there for days with you. Holy yeah, God. I, I've been thinking about posting some of my pictures in the uh, collecting group. You should do. I have, like, I have, like almost all the uh, Optimus Primes. I got, like, Ultron. Uh, let's see. I got, like, a, I got a Spawn uh, robot that's, like, two feet tall. Jesus, that sounds awesome. I mean, nerd. Nerd! Will they be worth something when you die? What? <laughs> right in the distance, writing it all down. He didn't need this. Yay! Oh, I think I just broke my internet. Oops. Oh, there we go. It's alright, I fixed it again. Yay! And, and technically, it's your fault. I was finding the Ultraman just in case you actually said you wanted it at some point. <laughs> Spectre's fault. Oh, Spectre's fault. All right, okay. There we How go. How was uh, Batman? Does, does it work? Right. Um, I will give you the honest answer, but it will contain spoilers. Are you sure you still want the honest answer? Yeah. All right. The series of Batman is absolutely, truly amazing if we remove Batman from it. Because not only is he a sparkly vampire wannabe, he's a Batman wannabe as well. He tries to make it very edgy and emo, so it just kind of comes off as Tobey Maguire's Venom. And everyone who's seen that show knows exactly what I'm talking about. There's very little time we've actually been um, Bruce Wayne... A lot of times we've been Batman, getting his ass kicked, by the way, because he's shit at it. His car looks like he stole it off Mad Max when he wasn't looking. His motorbike looks like it's a rent of wreck from a local junkyard somewhere. His actual gadget belt has got about as much use as a vape pen at a fucking nightclub when everyone's taking ecstasy. It's just fucking ridiculous. Was this supposed to be like Batman Year One? or? Oh, no, no, this, this is even worse. The fucking series that I found out, because I was watching it, 
it's three hours long, by the way. And everyone's going, no, it's not. It's two hours, 57 minutes. Fuck off. It's three hours. So <laughs> I had a couple of minutes to neglect myself afterwards. I needed to be beaten with something for watching it. It turns out the entire movie is to launch a cluster of TV shows for HBO Max. 18 in total are based on that Batman movie's universe. They're calling it a reboot. Anything before that has now been classed as Arrowverse Batman, and this is the new arc. So, like, the Teen Titans, uh, Marvel's other one, the Doom Squad, or Doom Patrol. Yep. Okay. All sacked off into Arrowverse. Uh, and this one, the main ones that I know that are coming off, there's going to be a Catwoman series. Kind of interesting. That Catwoman was pretty cool and didn't mind getting the tits out. Um, then there's also going to be, what's going to be called... Um, Gotham PD but the name crapped out on people that didn't like it so they've called it Arkham just Arkham which is more about Gordon managing the people in Arkham there's going to be a mob series with Chris Farrell playing the Penguin uh, and there's a couple of animated series coming off and they're in talks to actually make another Batman series rather than bringing it out as a movie to make it more current <clears throat> I don't I don't know how I feel about this because <laughs> I like my pilot movies being told to me as they're a pilot. Then I can say, yeah, it's a pilot. It's shit. But they disguised it as a three-hour movie. <laughs> Fuckers. Okay. Yeah, so if I had to rate it in all fairness out of ten, for the whole ambience, wide angle and photo photography for the series, man, I'd give it a ten. All apart from one slip-up where they, they photographed something they shouldn't have done, the overall ambience for the film is really, really good. But then you tend to see into the realms of Batman, <clears throat> and he drops it from a glorious 10 out of 10 down to a 3 out of 10. And that's the truth. If you like Batman, you're going to be upset. Because, yeah, they, they don't literally explain Batman. Oh, yeah, they're making another spin-off with... Um, the Butler guy as well, Pennyworth. Oh, yeah. So instead of that series that just come out, they're now making another one with this other guy. So they're just trying to get every character they can and spin it off in a different direction. Can you say money grab? Money grab! Money grab! But um, HBO Max has apparently licensed all these shows, so it's going to be their universe. It's going to be their addition to their online streaming service. Yeah, well, in America, I live in England. We don't get that shit. It comes on somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's that's the honest um, answer for the Batman. I'm sorry if it upset anyone. But, you know, grow a bigger spine. <laughs> <laughs> and you could have come and watched it. We did it in Discord. Everyone was equally dischuffed. <laughs> I know, right? You actually took a little bit of time out. And I was like, you're not watching Gintama? Yeah, I am. I'm getting DT. I've got to go back. I've got to go back. <laughs> Even Seabitch came in for a little bit. But I believe she fell asleep. I was trying to watch it because it was so goddamn long. So I went in there and watched a little bit and then I was like, oh, okay, I'm back there with that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy that everyone, like, just remember, if we can't show the anime on here, we will generally have nights on Discord or we can always air movies and stuff in Discord as well for people to watch when it's all worth watching. We did um, Jackass in there twice because we watched a dodgy sham copy, which was still all right, and then we watched the proper Blu-ray when it came out, which was phenomenal. We still had fun with the sham copy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the, real one the next movies that I will be putting into the Discord, in case anyone's interested, I'm going to be a giant child and watch Sonic 2 when it comes out on DVD, and I actually want to watch Morbius so I can pick it apart and call it shit. Which one? Well, you can't, if you can't remember what it is, we can't fucking watch it, can we? Uh, I can't remember. 
you don't know what it is, you don't get to watch it. Mm. Never gonna get nowhere with those fucking attitudes in life, man. I just forgot to do the Gintama movie. Yeah, did you enjoy your birthday message in Discord? We tried our hardest. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, no. What do you mean? There was a Popeye movie with um, Robin Williams, man. New movie. Uh, new one. You can't make a new one! Robin Williams would turn in his grave! They made a new one. Oh my god. <laughs> Up and look at the, look, yeah. I'll do it in a second. I'm just trying to get the Gintama movie start. Jesus. So, I guess they were telling the truth. <laughs> That's a good thing in the channel. People do joke a lot, but no one really lies. So, it's all the truth, which is worse. Yeah. Right. So for anyone who actually missed the animes that were streamed in the last couple of days and the movies, they are all now concealed within the VODs. The VODs now total over 300 full-length animes and anime series, which you can access due to subs for the channel. By the way, if you ever want to do me a favour, don't send bits, send somebody a sub and wish them a happy day. Because that's always better for them than it is for me. I'm just trying to be nice out here and give anyone as much anime as they can without the adverts. <laughs> What? Everything, everywhere, all at once. That was the movie. What movie? Everything, everywhere, all at once. You can keep saying the title to me, but why are you saying the title to me? Oh! You fucking context, bitch! You can't just go, oh yeah, everything, everywhere, all at once. Well, I've heard women say the same thing to me, and I'll tell you the same thing I tell them. I'll do what I can, but I mean, I'm only a man. <laughs> Everywhere, or uh, every, everywhere. Everything, everywhere, all at once. Everything, everywhere, all at once. See, this is just. It hurts. What the hell? Jimmy Lee Curtis is doing a voice in this. Michelle Yo? James Hong? Oh my God! And in case anyone's wondering why I'm shocked at the word James Hong, he was Ming the Merciless! Learn your shit! My god. And in case you don't know who Ming the Merciless is, I'm not talking to you anymore. That was Big Trouble in Little China. Frost, can you at least pick a movie that's out for me, you know? Not one that's still coming out! That is out. It is not! You know about live action or anime? You want an anime movie? No, 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 no. You, you're on about live action, right? I can get you the live action. I can't play it unless it's in the fucking Discord, though. Yeah, no, I was just saying the movie I was waiting for uh, that I wanted to see. That's, that's what I was talking about. Uh, the King of the, the Forest, the King of the Deer is that one as well. Uh, uh, the other movie. Fair enough. God damn it, man. He didn't do nothing. I know, but I just don't want to. I'm not here to play. It works. It works. I don't think you're playing well. Ah, fuck's sake. 
expect me to see this while crying, wouldn't it? Are you talking with me, Bob Starker, who's getting a movie? Yep. I that place when I went to the theater, and I was, I was, I don't, I don't know how to feel about that. Because I like the series, and I like, you know, H. John Benjamin. He's a good voice actor, you know, he does a lot of different shows, but I don't know if I can actually watch a movie. Rescue Rangers is getting a new movie? Disney's giving everything movies. Disney has to give everything movies because they're about to be fucked. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> you might be um, horrified to hear that there are some talks for Buzz Lightyear live action um, where he gets turned into a real boy. Honestly, it's all the kind of things that make me have nightmares on an evening. It really is. You guys go to bed thinking anime. I go to bed thinking, oh my god, what anime am I going to be cursed with today? <laughs> That's what I have to deal with. Oh no, that looks funny as fuck. Superman's dog's in charge. Yeah, Crypto. Sorry, uh, you can't say that word to me. I was thinking of something else. <laughs> well, yeah, that's kind of along the lines of what I was thinking of. Pussy in boots. That's a bitch. What the hell's happened to my computer? Well, that's gonna. Whoa! What the fuck was that? Really? You had to take it to that kind of place? What's wrong with you? Black Black Superman's being released soon as well. Avatar 2. Is it fit floating like that now? No, sir. Is Avatar ever coming out? Because I'm sick of waiting for it. Yeah, Avatar 2. <laughs> Read the read the chat. Read the chat. <laughs> uh, right. In answer to your question, in the most polite way I can, one, that anime is unable to be streamed in anybody's live stream. If you even own up or have said you have streamed that, you are instantly banned due to the exquisite level of sexual content. Within that show, it is literally about reviewing whorehouses. You will have seen it in my list because it was streamed in my Discord. We did a live review of it. Everyone is more than welcome to come and watch anything they want with us, and we generally will show it. But if it has got nudity in of that kind of nature, you'd need to join the Discord, request that we play it one night, and I can promise you... We quite happily will. I seen somebody yesterday get banned after watching it. Exactly. A lot of people don't pay attention to what they're doing and they get hit with a ban hammer so severe Thor himself would be left with blue balls. <laughs> but yeah, by all means, jump into our Discord. You know, act how you'd like. We've got a lot of stuff in there. And yeah, just request a night when you want it putting on and we'll stick it in the Discord and leave it streaming for you. Not an issue. <laughs> That's a good point, actually. I should get another Discord account made and actually call it Stream so I can just leave a laptop on and run movies in Discord when anyone wants. That's a good point. I told them not to watch it, but they didn't listen. Oh, you fucking star. That's actually kind of nice of you if you did. Uh, it's a shame they didn't listen to you then because so many streamers of this kind of content get taken down uh, I DM. No, you can DM or you can just ask for the link here and Frosty right above me here or over there will send it to you. No, no, if you're going to tell someone something's wrong, tell them in chat. Don't fuck about because the chat is where they'll see it if they're in between sorting shows out like this. If, however, there are a, shall we say, non-entity who doesn't engage with people, which there are a lot of anime streamers like that, 
Well, you are half asleep. You know, it, it, it's better to have a chat you can go where people want to chat to you. We try our best here. And we've got an army of bots. I do mean an army. There's Frost, there's Spectre, there's a list. <laughs> and Spectre gets to stay a mod because it annoys his wife. <laughs> it's the only bit of power he's got left outside the relationship. <laughs> So, the next anime that we've got coming up is Area 88, which is a lovely birthday present for Spectre. If you do have a birthday, the best thing we can offer in the channel is we give you an anime for your birthday of whatever you want. As long as it's not something too long. Normally I wouldn't have to state that, but you know what people are like when you say you can have an anime. They get a bit carried away. <sighs> but yeah, it's it's awesome. It's a lot of fun. I've lost things. Right. Does anyone have any other conversations, chat, and things they'd wish to talk about before we run away and we put on some anime? Ooh, actually I need to cross that file across. I, I thought I'd done it. I have done it. I'm an idiot. Audio. Dog, you keep on fucking bothering me. <laughs> Quit bothering me, dog. Quit bothering me. <laughs> View. Do, 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 do. Of the locker woman. Now. Sorted. Right. That's that done. Is it sorted? Is it really? Shut up. You know it's going to go wrong at any moment. You know it will. I love the style with the retro TVs and so. Well, thank you ever so much. We are retro as we can be. I mean, it's a bit bad being trapped inside this TV screen. But I get revenge because I trapped him in one as well. <laughs> No, you're not. You're, you think you are, but you're not. Never going to be through. See, I've now made him full screen. He can't escape at all. I didn't even have a comment section. <laughs> hey, not from me. From you. Yeah. Oh, God. It's like Naruto. Ninja's vanished. <laughs> Take care, Devin Ryder. Have a lovely day. Uh, whatever you get up to, I hope you enjoy the sun and your weather's not shit. <laughs> yeah, so where he is, that's our Discord group. Anybody with a web camera is more than welcome to come and join on these streams. We don't discriminate against nobody. By the way, if there's more women out there... Hello! Hello! We have the most unwoman nominated stream ever. We've got like two, I believe. Star, who's been not around lately because, bless her, she's working too hard. And Sea Witch, who can only be on when she escapes the children that plague her life. So, it kind of seems bad that the stereotype about anime weebs is real and we're all male looking for body pillows. <laughs> Point the camera on my wife sometimes. That a little bit. Make sure she's dressed before you do it. I don't need to go and get beaten by your wife when I come to America. It'll be so wedge, yeah. I I don't know. It's not my idea of fun. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I don't, like, whenever I stream, I, I usually don't have my camera on because it's free. Yeah, I had to be careful with that when Kay used to come around and visit because she was very liberal with her tongue tongues, her titskies, and her violent ba boom, ba boom, ba boom as the way past as she goes. <laughs> Actually, it was kind of bad with that other friend that I had staying about a week and a half ago. She stood behind me, she's like, Are you streaming? She leant right forward. In the loosest fitting dress I've ever known anyone. And if she'd have coughed 
her nipples would have fucking fired from that dress like artillery shells and taken my fucking head off. They were big. But yeah, only a few people saw that, thank God. It was like... Oh, Hello. Hello, how are you doing? I was just saying we need more women in here. Where have you been? Um, I'm doing well, how are you? Well, I'm short, fat, and English, so most of my problems are mental. <laughs> nah, I'm okay. <laughs> have you... Um, he, he, he gave me the phone, I just... Well, we were saying we were saying to him that we need more women in the channel. But if he ever points the camera at you, we have to make sure you're dressed because we know you do your modelling. <laughs> yes, of course it is. I'm gonna sit the fuck down, chill out, and put my feet up, and that husband's gonna run around and do as he bastard told, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So this is where I normally show, up, and this one up there is where the Discord camera will come up. If you turn the camera on on Discord, you turn up up there with Frost. No, he he has you on the seventy-five inch. And I, I, I was out. Oh, hang on. I'm on a 75 inch. Wait a minute. It's going to look bigger than it has been. I'm buff as fuck. I'm on 75 inch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've got to try and look big because we're on a bigger TV. There we go. Uh, if I go any lower, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna get. If I go down here, we're gonna find a bit more than people bargain for. <laughs> Put your shirt back on, some people could be eating. You know, some. I'm gonna turn around and bend up and get some off the floor if you continue. And I tell you now, you'll see more cracked than the Grand Canyon trophy, husband. Just saying. Because arse, apparently, and male arse crack is not part of terms of service violation. Oh, I could get a lot. I've got a lot of arse. <laughs> I actually don't know where my shirt went, and it's really cold because my nipples are all erect. Fucking England, it's freezing. <laughs> right. In between throwing claws off and scantily clad male cleavage, um, obviously, I am not as hairy as my counterpart, Frost. He has a much more ample foliage. I look shaved. He looks like a Wookiee. So... Oh, no, no, this is bank cleavage. Mm, 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 mm. Ah. <laughs> God, that hurts. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs> uh, very. So, yeah, I hope everyone has a wonderful day. Hey, I can make my shoulders pop. I feel like I'm going to shit myself. I hope we might I hope we managed to make the lovely Mrs. Spectre laugh there, Spectre, for a bit. It's always nice. There. This is why there's no women in here. It's probably also another reason why there's no women in my life. <laughs> Leave more time for video games and anime! Yeah, that, it's not a bad thing, man. Women are lovely for what they're intended for. You thought I was going to be sexist. You thought I was going to say bad things. No, I'm not going to say sex, blowjobs, and behind-the-scenes action. No, a loving partner to embrace... Uh, yeah, no, fuck it. Yeah, for those three things to begin with. <laughs> no, it, it's nice to co-habitat with somebody, but in all fairness, 
I believe I am too insane, fucked in the head, and have too much anime in my life for a woman to take me as I am. I literally mean to fit a woman into my life, every room in my house is either a gym, a computer room, or a gym, or a computer room. There's no in between. And thank you ever so much, Mac, there, for saying insane is good. Yeah. I am kind of cold, Frost. And my t-shirt's in the all the way out there. Well, then hurry up and get done. <laughs> when I did that, it kind of launched. I'm like, you know when you and 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 this keeps rubbing on my nipple ever so excitingly. I'm, I'm getting quite excited. <laughs> mm. So I hope everyone's going to enjoy the upcoming anime. The upcoming anime is selected for Spectre John's birthday. It's Area 88. It will be shown in dub. Then after that, we have some more animes that people have picked. Nobody's used points, so all these things are interchangeable if you use any points at all. Except the Area um, 88, because it's a birthday present. Anybody in the channel, if you do have a birthday and you wish to have an anime picked, like I said, just let us know or let one of the mods know and we'll get it sorted. Frost, so what's your plans for the rest of the day before I run off? Because I'd have to join on Discord again if you're going to be about. I don't know what you're doing. All right, well, in that case, I'll be back on Discord after I've left this channel and started the anime playing, okay? Right. right, I'll see you in a few minutes. Say goodbye to everyone. Bye. Hey, look, Luna! <laughs> see you later, Spectre. Hang on a minute. Spectre, say goodbye. Oh, he's gone. Damn it. Oh, well. Motherfucker. I'm gone. Okay, so that is that done and dusted. <sighs> Where we are. I hope you all enjoyed the upcoming anime. I am going to go find some clothes because not only am I nipple free and fancied, I'm cold as fucking fat man. So, like Trophy Husband said, this is not how you get women coming to my channel. Watching what we stream and engaging in the madness is not conducive to your pulling techniques. We will not be able to help you get laid. We will not be able to help you seduce the next woman that you fancy. However, we will be able to show you a damn good time, show you a little bit of humour, and definitely, if you find it hard to find the anime that you've dreamed of watching for many, many years, we can dig it out, and we will show it for you. Even if it's got titties, just go to the Discord. Take care, have fun, and I'll see you later on when the animes are done. Bye. Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, depending on where you are in the world. That is the end of that one. And yes, I am here. One second. Hello, everyone. We're on the anime channel. Um, how are you all doing? That's Frost in the background playing Wii's Box. So, the anime was missing subs, and the last one was a bit of an all hectic mess, but we got it all sorted in the end. I am now here because we're going to literally get all this shit sorted, and then we can start playing more anime. Oh, damn. So, who got to watch the last anime that was being played, and did they enjoy it? Hi there, Orphan Smash. How are you doing? <laughs> right, so, while we're here, I'm going to VOD the last anime, um, like, so we can get that into the VODs. I've got to kind of clean it up a little bit as well, because there was a rather large mess on it while it was playing. we got... Do, 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 do. So, Wolf, did you watch any of the last one, or have you seen it before? Uh, I've seen it before, but a long time ago, like like, like I said, when it first came out on VHS. Right. Well, you didn't say that while it was on the anime stream. It was on the gaming one. <laughs> <It's you. laughs> Look, it's not my fault. I don't make up the rules. You know what I mean? Yeah, well, I just said it now. Oh, look at you, touchy man. Yeah, very true. All right, I gotta try and find where this anime starts. It, 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 that one is a, it is a classic. It's a very old one. Like, 
They're not that old compared to that. That's what they usually watch. <laughs> 1970s. Man, the stuff you usually watch is ancient. You know it is. I know it is. Everyone else is like, it's what the classic. fuck? <laughs> just it, it, when anime was anime. Just because you say it's a classic doesn't make it so. Okay. You can't blame me for being that freaking old. No, no, never do, never do. <laughs> <laughs> that, that only means that you're following behind my footsteps. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, I'm going to try and find where the episode repeated now. This is going to be a nightmare. Alright, so that's where it ended, I think. And I was in the other room. I was playing the anime. There it is. Got it. Oh. Jeez. That was a nightmare. To try and fix the episode of the anime, we've got to find where it all messed up. So I'm going to literally go back and repair the thing so I know where it is. Uh, so thank you to everyone for being so patient while I'm doing this. I do apologize because I know it's a pain in the ass, But it makes the VOD better because then it's not fucked, basically. There we go. So that was uh, Area 88, wasn't it? Yeah. Sorted. I don't know why this anime is not in fucking English either. Oh, that's why. Back. What anime? Oh, the new one? Yeah, it's a newer one, so it doesn't actually have... Um, is so... it itself in Comet Lucifer? Yes. I thought it was. I thought they dubbed Comet Lu Lucifer, but I must be wrong. I thought they did too. I wish it wasn't sub, so... Well, yeah, I knew it'd come out in sub, but I mean, I thought it'd been done in dub before I'd stuck it on. Obviously, that one's not it. Um, I didn't have time. I was very tired when we were messing around the other night because, you know, it was 7 o'clock this morning, I believe, we were putting all these on at. So I was quite tired, and I didn't get off the stream. Are you having a shit? Stop having a shit! Jesus, if you sound like that when you're moving around, that's bad, man. Oh, it's not what you're supposed to sound like in your age, moving around, moving around, moving around, oh, moving around. <laughs> Jesus. Save image as done. Boom. Publish. Oh, that's all right for you. It is being dubbed. Yeah, it is an English dub. Right, okay. Two seconds then. Mm -mm -mm. It was unique. Uh, I did. Haha. <laughs> War is hell. Dude in the literal signed his life away. God damn. It wasn't dubbed either. No, a lot of the time um, we don't play stuff that's dubbed, but we will show something that's. Um, it depends. Uh, Spectre picked the last one, which was dubbed, and we managed to play all of it. It was a bit fucked up in stop, stop. What? What are you about? You said no. Because the last... No. What was? The last one. No, it wasn't. Area 88? No, it was dubbed. Was it? Yeah. Because some of the fuck-up episodes were subbed, but we fucked them off. And I redid them, so we only got them dubbed. Right. I wasn't saying it wasn't either subbed. Look at you. 
nomadic squirrels just broke my mind. I'm confused. It's okay, I'll live. I'll be fine. I don't know what's going on in the world anyway. Look, that's Frosty wandering around his living room, don't know what he's doing. <laughs> right. Um, in between quickly going pick a ball, I was supposed to be looking for this. So, uh, comment Lucifer. Oh, welcome to my world. Uh, yeah, well, I can go downstairs. <laughs> I can go downstairs. I can go downstairs and get coffee. Yes, but that means you have to go downstairs. Up and down the stairs. I can't see Comet Lucifer subbed. I mean, dubbed. Nope. That'd be right. Oh, dear lordy lords. Well, then, I suppose we should ask the group. We have got 16 people in here. Um, would you like a subbed anime or a dubbed anime? Choices are yours. You realize that means you care, right? I don't really care unless it sucks, which basically means I fucking care and it better not oh, suck. But well, how am I supposed to know if it sucks or not until I play it? Yeah, you watch it first. It's like going out with a girl. You don't know if she gives you the goods and swallows until it's too late. So. I'm not going to date you unless before we start dating, you tell me whether you swallow. So you're going to leave a long time. Yep. Ah! The inspector's like, as long as it's violent. Mm -hmm. I'll re enable the sub so we can play whatever. I prefer a dubbed. Well, of course you do. A lot of people can't be asked to read. <laughs> but if it was that last one, I'll take subbed. <laughs> okay, I'll tell you what. Um, we've got 16 people here. We have got... There is Comet Lucifer, which is subbed. Then we've also got... Um, shit. How to get... The, the guy that got the Kingdom Art of Debt, which is a ridiculously long title, but that's actually what it is. Yeah. The Prince Who Would Sell His Kingdom. Apparently that's what it's called. Mm, that one is also a dub. Oh my god, two dubs back to back. That's a bit shady. Then we have doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo -doo. something's not put up on the screen just yet. God damn it! Let him fucking show me what you got. Huh? I, I'm confused now. I found one that says something to pick it up, but when I go to it, it just sucks. So, what are you doing now? Well, the next animes are all subs and um, not dub. I don't know. I'm just asking people what they wanted. There's like 16 people here and nobody's really talking. Oh. Well, if they're not saying anything, that means they would love to watch the sub. <laughs> yeah. uh, you have, they have been given the choice to choose. Mm -hmm. So that means they're mining points. Ah! You know how to put a stop to mining points. It's really easy. Yeah, reset the server. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just going to very quickly reset the server. So give me a moment. Um...